All right. Hang on. So I got home and this was my little haul from Poundland. Hadn't been in a while, so obviously had to spend a fortune to feel justified. Apparently I could not wait to open this soap. It does smell really nice actually, but this cost a pound. Was quite happy with the price. Definitely would buy again. And then we have this one that actually smells like the little candied love hearts. Again, a pound. Would 100% buy again because we run out of hand wash all the time. Every fat girl's dream. These are really nice cookies, Cadbury cookies. They were a pound also. Then we have these washing up gloves. I got two packs because who likes touch and drain food? A pound each. And here we have the microfiber duster, which actually cost me 150 Like, no. Yeah, that's not even good. I needed it. I was a desperation to get one of these. But maybe shop on Timu next time. And then we have the absolute amazing Toblerone. They were 50p each. Very happy with those. And then we have the spaghetti, which, to be fair, it's the same thing, just by a different brand, 75p each. Not mad. And then we have this beautiful velour pumpkin, like, I couldn't resist. So the pumpkin was £1.50. Absolutely cute. These, however, £2 a pop, I, don't, I just, I don't know if that's justified. I just needed to try them, you know, probably won't buy them again. And the matte lipstick, really nice colour. So this was £2.50, which I don't mind because I really love the colour. And then it brings me to this lacklustre foundation, £1. So it's not a huge loss. Hopefully this does me some justice though. I want to know that pound's been well spent. I know for a fact that I'm going to love this matte lipstick. It dries down super quick. It's just really hard to get a good angle so to show you the applicator and what it actually looks like. But in love, absolutely. These mugs were one fifty each. I love these. We'll be uh, using one every so often. So we have Werther's Original. If you guys get Werther's Original out where you live, let me know which your favourite is. We have the Eclairs. We have the Original. Oh, no, we don't. We have Eclairs again because they were very important. One twenty five a pack, I might add for all of them, the chocolate covered, creamy filling and the original. These were 50p each. These are like gourmet lollipops. So the blue ones are supposed to be candy floss flavor. The pink is bubble gum and the red is watermelon. Hopefully the boys are really gonna enjoy these because they're like part of their Halloween sweets. So fingers crossed. These little robins are like one thirty-five a pack. I don't think I would buy them again if I went back in time. Tea light candles, always need them, two twenty-five a pack. You get 50 in a pack. Definitely brilliant because of my wax melts. Tonics tea cakes, staple, one pound a pack. McCart gold, I believe that was a pound. I got two of those, by the way. And then Jacob's cream crackers, one seventy-five for a twin pack. Really surprised at these noodle bowls. They're really quite good. So 150 each. Come with a little fork. Adorbs. These notepads are fantastic. So this A5 was a pound. The A6 was two pound, surprisingly. And the A4 was two pound fifty. But I would definitely purchase them again once they've been used up because they are brilliant. And then it brings me to this amazing glass bowl. 
actual glass beautiful pumpkin bowl we're going to be using it for sweets right now but like throughout the year I might just put lights in and stuff like that because I just find it adorbs so yeah I will put a picture or a little video at the end of this and this is how she looks put together nicely absolutely love it on the table next to everything so obviously I wasn't just content with Poundland, I had to go to Morrison's. I had a 12 inch pizza for 4 75 super spicy, would get it again. Peppers were 175 the red onions were 95 pence. I've got some humongous courgettes, they're called wonky courgettes but they're massive. They were £2.50 and the bread was 69 pence. I mean, I'm not mad. And then I still wasn't content so I had to go to farm foods. I got three lots of bar drinks. I got the bubble gum, the limeade and the lemonade all for £18. Angel Delight was £3.99 a pot. You have the cream cheese, which was £2.97 per tub. Tin foil was £5.18 for two. The slabs crisps was £1.99 a pack. The garlic seasonings were any four for £2.40. The cheese was £1.79. We have the coffees that are 79p each. We have some pink biscuits in the corner, which were 99p. Pasta, which was, was apparently not even on my receipt, so I have no idea. These cakes, 129 a pack. The crisp and dry was 299. And then these pralines were 199 a pack. And on with the freezer food. So we have the cheddar bites, the cheese and garlic bites, the chili bites, that was three for £10. We then have some masala fries up top, which I absolutely love. They're one ninety nine a pack. And then we have these amazing ice creams, signature ice creams, two ninety nine a tub. Thanks for watching guys, see you in the next one, bye!